And the PSG team looks like this. Gianluigi Donnarumma begins in goal. Sergio Ramos plays alongside Marquinhos in central defence. Lionel Messi starts with Neymar out wide. And the main striker today is Kylian Mbappe. And this is how it looks for Chelsea. Thiago Silva plays with Antonio Rudiger in central defence. N'Golo Conte starts alongside Jorginho in the centre of midfield. And handed the task of playing up front today, Romelu Lukaku. And they're underway now in the Champions League final. We're about to find out which team is the best in Europe. Bernat Verratti Messi and he's going to be disappointed with that pass well who would be a defender responsibility is one of trying to shackle Neymar well he's such a natural finisher he has everything a good goal scorer needs composure technique and awareness he will certainly need to be tightly marked today Giving the ball away. Oh, a nice looking pass. Just had to keep his concentration to the maximum, and he did. And over comes the corner. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Bernat. Neymar. Idrissa Gay. Wijnaldum. Now with Messi. And Messi carries it forward. What's he going to do from this position? Can they fall? And a big chance at that, Derek. He should have put them in the driving seat there. Jorginho. Rather than a free kick, it's advantage Chelsea. Free kick to Chelsea. Mount. Good looking sequence. Given away by Chelsea. Mbappe. Hakimi. Verratti, now Neymar, Bernat, moving the ball effectively, Messi, Hakimi, a poor cross all things considered, and here he is Lionel Messi, and a decent save, full credit. Mbappe, well read to ease the pressure. Neymar, here's Mbappe, Wijnaldum, passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. A good and fair challenge. Messi. And Neymar. Messi. Has a go. My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel.
It's Neymar's corner. And they can't quite take advantage in the end. Lukaku. Oh, nice ball. Mount. Crossed accurately towards the far post. Goalkeeper's ball. The cross delivered too close to him. Hakimi. Wijnaldum now. Mbappe. Verassi. And return to Mbappe. Shot attempted. Able to get a body in the way. Oh, the flag's gone up. And there wasn't much in that. Chilwell on the ball Rudiger Jorginho PSG doing well to win it back Verratti Neymar well, it looked highly promising but they got nothing out of it Pulisic excellent ball over the top Jorginho and he's missed the opportunity to net the opening goal well it should be 1-0 Derek you can see how frustrated he is with himself The first half here comes to an end. Into the second half then, in this battle for Champions League glory. Ngoro Conte Lukaku Jorginho well that's how to break the spirit of the attacker ball's gone now Chelsea showing good width speculative ball fired to the near post well it was pretty straightforward for the goalkeeper Marquinhos. And now Gay. Idrissa Gay. Wijnaldum now. Bernat. Idrissa Gay. Wijnaldum now. Oh, he's given the ball away. Mount. Really a very poor ball. Messi. Lukaku. Might be a chance here. Oh, marvellous goalkeeping. Well, it's a top class save from a top class goalkeeper. That's absolutely brilliant. Now the delivery, and under pressure, that was a fine claim.
Messi. And now Gay. Now just couldn't keep the ball. Attacking possibilities for Chelsea. That's Pili Quetta. The delivery towards the back post. Simple for the keeper. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. Hakimi. Wijnaldum now. Wijnaldum. Verratti now. Showing patience as well as persistence in the build-up. And return to Mbappe. And in with a real chance. Majestic piece of goalkeeping. Well, he loves the big moments, doesn't he? And he's proved it again there. Great goalkeeping. Fired in by Neymar. Not really the ideal clearance. Neymar. A very effective clearance. Well, he had a decent reading of that ball in. Mbappe. To jump in front. And Neymar. Well, offside anyway, albeit a tight one. Jorginho Wijnaldo. Neymar. Verratti. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Pulisic. On to Jorginho. Chilwell. Trailing as they are, they're not likely to get too many opportunities late in this game. Super save, and they stay in the lead. That's a big save and a big moment. He's just won them the game here. <laughs> Elects to go short. Targets available. Cross comes in. Well, not quite accurate enough. Well, his movement was good. He attacked it well, but he just got underneath it. Well, the final whistle is almost upon us. PSG would dearly love to hear it. Will they get the win here? Stuart, your thoughts on their performance? Well, it's been a tight game, but I think they've been the better team. They've just had that little bit more quality, certainly in attack. And, of course, they've been well organised at the back. They just need to see this through now. 
Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Do they have the guile to up and up the defence? This, this could level it. Foiling his opponent completely. And it's gone behind for the corner. Over it comes. It comes to absolutely nothing. It is a decent looking attack here. Textbook defending inside the box. Full time. Parisian pride shines through. PSG have cleared the final hurdle in the Champions League. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Paris Saint-Germain. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow this.